According to the United Nations High Commissioner for Refugees, a refugee is someone who has been forced to flee his or her country because of persecution, war, or violence. A refugee has a well-founded fear of persecution for reasons of race, religion, nationality, political opinion, or membership in a particular social group. It's important to keep in mind that when someone is a refugee, going home isn't an option. It's also important to distinguish between a refugee and an immigrant because they are not the same thing. An immigrant is a person who moves to another country because they want to. Their reason might include being closer to family, finding a better job, or desiring a higher standard of living. This is not the case for a refugee as they have no choice. Sometimes, these hostile situations can affect very large groups of people. When this happens, we call it a refugee crisis. In these situations, the pressures on systems that typically deal with refugees become extremely strained and often cannot keep up with the demand. Refugee care refers to the programs which make sure that refugees are taken care of and have the right support needed for them as they are placed in and adapt to a new environment. In recent years, the number of refugees has increased significantly due to widespread military conflict. In fact, a recent study by the UNHCR showed that there are over 22 million refugees around the world, the largest number since the Second World War. What a refugee faces is really difficult. Not only have they been forced to leave their home, often with very few of their belongings, but they must often also learn a new language as they attempt to adapt to a life in a new country. Before entering this new life, extended stays in refugee camps is normal. These camps have only the most basic of shelter provided, even during cold months, and are able to provide very limited amounts of food, have very restricted healthcare services, and almost always are unable to offer education for children. So what can you do? First, take time to become educated about the needs of refugees and the importance of refugee care. Consider how you can be a voice for someone who has been displaced from their home and might be struggling. If you find out that there is a refugee in your area, it would be encouraging to them if you would introduce yourself and even to teach them a little bit about their new home. Finally, be sure to check out Katoa's projects related to refugee care. Learn all you can, vote, and have your say in which project you believe Katoa should support. Oh, and one last thing. Your voice matters, so be sure to share your vote on social media and encourage others to join our movement that is seeing people everywhere help people everywhere. Because simply stated, people everywhere matter.